What we're going to do here is we're going to what are we going to do here? Yeah, okay, tell you what, what we're going to do here is we're going to change that. Uh, we want that as an outie, we're going to, and that's going to be a simple one to set up. Let's reorganize a little bit here because I seem to be swapping stuff around lots. Okay, so this outie, just tell it to just let everything out. So everything will go out into this pipe. But this one, we want it to just, we want it to stop certain things coming into this, this chest. And the things I want it to go, to stop getting in, let's get rid of that, uh, actually, stack, there we go. All right, so we want the first nine things, and there's these nine things we want to see stuff that we don't want to compress. I will show you why in a minute. So that's, that's, that. That is very important. Uh, limestone, in cigarro fruit, exotic seeds, certus quartz, certus quartz dust, and redstone. Okay, so those nine items will not go into this chest. Okay, so we're turning it to blacklist, yellowium dust, amber, emeralds, exotic seeds, cigarro fruit, limestone, certus quartz, certus quartz dust, and redstone. Okay, so there. Uh, What have we got wrong here? So I think it's a blacklist these possibly oh, possibly this stuff was all in beforehand though. So we'll see in a sec. Yeah. Yeah, this stuff's not disappearing. Okay, so it looks like what happened was that stuff went in here before we had a chance to tell it not to, so let's just take it out. Limestone, diamond, that one there. Okay, so just pop this stuff in here. As you can see now, the only stuff building it up in here is um, the stuff that uh, won't go into that chest. So now what we can do is we can just put another chest on top of here. Like that. And everything else will go in there, you see. Okay, and that's our first one. So let's make another pipe. Don't want that. Let's put down another chest. Okay, so we're going to now pull stuff out of here. And... Well, stuff we don't want is we don't want diamond, we don't want blaze powder, we don't want glowstone dust, we don't want quicksilver drops, and we don't want appetite. Okay, so let's configure these quickly. So blacklist that, and we'll say don't do blaze powder, don't do glowstone dust. Don't do diamonds, don't do appetite, and don't do quicksilver drops. And I've changed my mind about the glowstone, actually. Uh, so this is going to stop those things from going in there. At this chest. Let's put this in. We should say we should whitelist this stuff. So that will go in there. That will go in there. That will go in there. And that will go in there. And if we just configure this last bit, make that an LT. Say so blacklist nothing. So we'll ignore. There we go. Stuff's emptying out in here, and we got stuff we like in there, and stuff we like in there. Okay.
Oh, I think we've made a slight mistake here, but it looks like... Yes, I think we have. Let's just stick some stuff in here. Get rid of these. Okay. Um... Emeralds, Certus Quartz... Do you see we're actually getting stuff... other than what we want in here? Because we actually didn't specifically tell it not to put stuff in, and I think it was limestone. Uh, and exotic seas as well. Unfortunately we've got all of them, so what we should do here is tell it to whitelist, so only allow in these items. I knew I forgot something. So just chuck that in there. I missed, I missed, right down. Like that, and exotic seeds, yeah, and emerald. There we go. All right. So just pop that back in here, and that'll filter itself through. And in the meantime, let's go and get this stuff, which we didn't want to go in there, and pop that back in here like this and that will filter itself through as well it'll go rather than coming up into here it'll go through here and some of it will end up up here but the bulk of it will end up down here okay now we want to move these things out of the way I feel so let's get this chest out of the way let's move it um, let's just put it here for now, like that, and that chest as well, just put that in front of the generator there, there we go, and that gives us a bit of space, so this stuff, oh, oh, put it back your fault, there we go, right, okay, this stuff, what we now want to do is, is we actually want to, this, this stuff is great, this is still all stuff we want, okay, but we want to... oh, we missed one. Put cactus seeds in there, there we go. And... There's the cactus seed. Looks so much like ore I didn't see it, so we'll put that cactus seed in there, there we go. So that'll end up in here in a second. Right, okay, so the stuff we got in here can be compacted okay you see what we got if we take nine of these okay and where's my crafting table there's my crafting table okay so we can take nine of these items and if we put oh no is it four yeah it's four I think All right, so we take four of these and it makes nickel or gravel and that can be put into a furnace and made into nickel or which is what we used to build with. So this stuff is not really much use to us without being put into blocks. And we're gonna, we're actually, we're gonna do that with these things. Where are they? Uh, not the aqueous accumulators. Auto packages. There we are. And these we shall put in. Oh, it's not far enough away. So that type chest, pipe chest, there we go, that is exactly where we want them. So let's put a few of those down to start off with, two, oh you're going to be awkward aren't you? It's very important that they look the right way. There we go, so that's three of them. I'll put the fourth one on later on, perhaps. Now, what these things do is, when they give it a bit of power, which we shall sort out in just a second, they take anything that's in a chest of this size, and if it can be packaged into something, they will take it and put it into a chest on this side. So that's precisely what we're going to do. We'll put that one back for a second. And we need to go and get some electric power. Which we shall do here.
Nickel or gravel? Schrodinger's block. <laughs> No, I don't want to do that. No. No. Right, if these guys start prioritizing power, it's explosions all over the place. Awful, awful noises. And that's why they're my backup generators. So I built a nuclear reactor. I built a nuclear reactor to get away from the noise. So, let's go... One more. So now if we look at these guys, no. Now if we look at, the, oh yeah, there, there's no interaction on them, is there? Uh, all right, so now what we want to do is we want to put three chests here. One, two, Three, and we want to sort this stuff into these three chests, and we should do exactly, exactly the way as you're probably expecting at this point, with lots and lots of piping. So, one, two, three, okay, and now we need to get the stuff we want to put in there. So, let's clear that out for a second. And the first set will be. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so this one we shall put that in there and we shall configure it with an empty hand. So we tell it to whitelist, so only allow one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like that. So that will only allow those nine into the chest. Which I think we actually just tell it to go ahead and do, really. So make that an outy. Just tell it to go. There we go. Okay, so hey, see that all is starting to appear in there but nothing else is so well we can stick that stuff in there now and it can just go into the system like that and uh, so let's go and get the next nine one two three four five six seven eight nine one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve Yes, I remember Sesame Street. Alright, so we'll put one of those in and hit it with a red hand, bare hand and tell it to whitelist again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like that, so let's check, stick those in there. And it seems as if by accident, but we will tell it to whitelist the next nine, uh, which are, of course, the dusts. Oh, sorry, the crushed ore. We did the dust, didn't we? So this one will be, put one of those in again, and we'll say whitelist these nine. Cinnamon toast, yay. What babe? Alright, so there's nine there. Okay, and uh, turn that on. There we go. So take that out and take that out. These ones need to live in there for a bit. Okay, so we now have that stuff in there. Uh, let's 
that's broken. Whitelist, ignore. There we go. Right. Wonder where a lot of this stuff went. Let's take that out. Just put that back in there. Like that. Oh, missed the uh, coal. Alright, I'm gonna have a quick burger. Nom 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 nom. Alright, uh, let's take that out so we've got free hand again. So, there you go. Crushed, dust, and broken. And now, if we just put some chests on this side. It will just packages it for us. Simple as that. So everything will disappear off of this side and reappear over this side in a packaged format. Yeah, we don't have enough dust yet, which doesn't surprise me because it's going to be a long time, if you think about this, it's going to be a long while before we actually fill this gravel up and then fill the sand up and then to start filling the dust up. So... It's going to be a while before we fill these things up. So we're not going to be seeing dust products out of this for a while, which is a bit of a problem. But I do have another one of these that I can keep running upstairs until we get them. So there we go. We have all these things. Now, what we want to do is it's no good to us as gravel. So let's cook the stuff. And we'll do that with a redstone furnace. So we just pop that down. Where should we put it? Let's just put it down here. Like that. And then we're going to need to get some power around from that. I'll neaten this up later on, but I think what for now I'll do is I'll just take a, little, a line over the top here. Uh, I thought I was worried for a second I'd run out of these. So in the top there we go that powered up power filling up there now all we need to do is just get the stuff out of here and into into the furnace so like that and like that and just a bit quick configuration and there's no need to be neat about these ones, all we're just going to do is tell it to take everything and suck it out and put it into the furnace like that and there we go, that's lit up and that's taking the iron ore gravel and turning it into iron ingots which is exactly what we need so now we have these items we have these items six diamonds already, that's not bad Hey, don't tell me, okay? You talk to Shizzy. Sergeant Major Shizzy wanted it. Sergeant Major Shizzy got it. And, yeah, we have these items as well. And that's going to come to a stop in a second because there's nowhere for it to go. So the first thing we're going to do is let's give it another chest. There were reasons why I did lots and lots of chests. So we'll put that one in there. Like, like this. Give this the usual configuration job. Ignore nothing. There we go. And uh, there we go. So we get an iron, tin. Okay, so all this stuff is coming through here into there. So, as I said, we now have three chests worth of stuff which we need to get up to our item system. And we happen to have a pipe going up here, so we might as well make use to it, haven't we? So, I'll just do one and I'll come back and do the, ones, the rest of them later on. I'm going to do this one because it's incredibly easy to wire up. So I'm going to put a bit of pipe there. And I'm going to put a bit of pipe there. I'm going to hit this with a hammer. Oh, I hit it once too often. It must have been a bit of a wrench for it. And we'll tell it blacklist nothing and just... How do I hit it correctly? Like that. 
and that stuff will be sucked out from there into the system follow this pipe up up here and this pipe used to put uh, stuff into the where do you go Uh, looks like we're going to need to start moving it from here. Um, nom, 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 nom. Right, let's break this. Yeah, this used to be where I got the where I got the uh, the, the gunpowder in, but we're going to repurpose it. So we're going to take this pipe like that, like that, like that, and we need to connect it up somewhere. And I think. It's be so much easier when this is all moved, but for now, where should we connect it up? We just need somewhere, and I think, to be totally honest with you, this sounds weird, but I think this is probably going to be the best place. So we'll just run a pipe over here for now. I will neaten this up later on, but for now, I think it will do nicely. Oh, good lord, have I run out of these? Uh, let's make some more item ducks. Whew. It's not surprising. If you look at how much of this place is item duck, it's not surprising I run out of them all the time, is it? So let's just have a quick search. Alright, so I T E M item 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 ducks, and we want the opaque ones. Okay, so they are tin on the outside and lead on the inside. So let's get rid of this copper. Is that tin? Yeah, that's tin. And we'll just grab a few of those. Yeah, well, I'm nearly done. Uh, hey, look, if you guys want to go, go. It's, it's quite alright by me. Uh, I'm, I'm going to stop after I do this build anyway. So let's just finish this off. And there. So now we go down the bottom here. It does look nice from the top. I quite like this. Looks all Hey! How'd you get in here? How'd you get in here? Uh, I'll let you despawn. Okay, so anyway, yep. Yeah, okay, that's all gone. And the ingots we're creating uh running way away up there and into the system and what i'll do is i'll connect these two chests in later on but as you can see there you go whole system and with a bit more space i want to expand this to uh to include the uh, nether rack as well yeah he's stealing from me i can't get over there um what the hell You, mate, and I, we need to have a word, and the word is pain. <laughs> Alright, let's have a quick look and see where we can... S where, did he where did he come from? Oh, I didn't want to do that, because I just picked up everything that was going down the channel. I need to find, I really, really need to find where he came from because otherwise they'll just appear all over the place, which will be painful. But I can do that later on. So, guys, there we go. Very, very simple automated system. Oh, look. Look. Space is on top of the, uh, the power cables, of course. So, you'll need to come back with some torches and sort that out. But anyway, yeah, very, very simple automated power system for feed beast type things. 
I hope that wasn't too boring for you. And I hope I can get out of here because I'm not entirely certain I can. There we go, right. Okay, so, right, L Laura is going to be live streaming in a couple of minutes, and I'm fairly certain I'm going to lose you guys as soon as she does. So I'm going to accept the inevitable, and I'm going to cut this one ha uh, a little bit short. Uh, I hope you guys had fun, and thank you so very much for putting up with all the, the annoyance of uh, yesterday's live stream, and coming along to this one It's gr greatly appreciated. And I'll finish this off when I've got a jetpack and I can hover from above because that'd be so much easier. Oh, you were so sweet, iridescent Lily. Lily. Thank you very much. Okay, right. Welcome back, me! Hey! hey. Um, <laughs> well, you go and do it anyway because uh, she doesn't live stream very often, so make the most of it. And I shall see you all later. Um, we'll try again on Wednesday. I've had a complaint with I've had a complaint at Beam. I'm getting sick and tired of this. So if it doesn't work anymore, we might change the live stream time or indeed change the live stream location. Um, I, I'm not. I, I like Beam, but I will leave it if it keeps on messing us around. Well, I was only going to live stream for another half an hour, and I don't really have anything to do. I've already died twice and built a complete machine, so. I think I've done all right for an hour and a half. So you guys pop on, and I shall see you all next week, okay? No, not Twitch. I'm not going back to Twitch. So, tatty -way.